Fantastic Adventure. Let's go on Astrobot. So we can learn more about God. And Black Off. Hello there, space friends. We're so glad you're here. I'm Turbo. And I'm Scooter. We are special outer space astronauts. We travel the planets near and far. And we use our special helmets to tell us where we are. Each week we blast off into outer space on very important space missions. Do you think it would be fun to fly in our rocket on very important space missions? Yeah! yeah. Then do you boys and girls want to be part of our space crew? Yeah! Hip hip hooray! It's going to be out of this world. Oh right, and I'm sure glad to have you as part of our space crew. Now the first thing we have to do is check our fuel tank to see if we have enough fuel to blast off into outer space. Our robot friend, Astrobot, tells us if our fuel tank is empty or full. We start up Astrobot by doing the robot rock. Stand up and do it with us now. Astronauts, I see that your fuel tank is on empty. You need a story from God's Word to fill you up. Does your space crew know what God's Word is? That's right! When you fill up on God's Word, you'll be ready for every important mission. Today's Bible story comes from a book in the Bible called Jonah. It's about a boy named Jonah. Space crew, can you say Jonah? Jonah was a prophet. Prophets are God's special messengers. One day, God told Jonah to go to a place called Nineveh. God wanted Jonah to tell the people in Nineveh to stop doing bad things. Astronauts, 
Can you hold out your hand and say stop? That's it. But Jonah did not want to go to Nineveh with this message from God. So he got on a boat to sail across the sea. God sent a big storm to stop Jonah. Space crew, can you wiggle your fingers like it's raining? Good job, crew! Jonah told the sailors that the storm would stop if they threw him out of the boat. So the sailors threw Jonah out of the boat and the storm stopped. Just then a big fish swam by and swallowed Jonah. Everybody in the rocket say, gulp, like the fish. Gulp? That's it. Now everyone hold up three fingers. Good job. Jonah was inside the big fish's belly for three days and nights. Then Jonah prayed to God and said, please forgive me. God forgave Jonah and told the fish to spit Jonah out onto the shore. Then God told Jonah again to go and tell the people in Nineveh to stop doing bad things. Jonah obeyed and the people in Nineveh were sorry for doing bad things. So God forgave them. Astronauts, God also forgives you and me when we do wrong things. Repeat this after me. God promises to forgive me. That was a galactically great job, crew. Astrobot, tell us if today's Bible story filled up the rocket's fuel tank. Your fuel tank is full. Pluto, perfect! Now that your tank is full of God's word, you can blast off on today's space mission. These aliens on the green dot planet were supposed to put on their shoes like their dad asked them to do, but they did not obey. Now they are in time out. They need to know that God promises to forgive them if they say that they are sorry. I need your astronaut crew to blast off and tell them about today's Bible story so they will know that God promises to forgive me. Have fun in outer space. Commander Cosmo, out. Now that our tank is full of God's word, we must get to the Green Dot Planet right away. Yes, those aliens need to know that God promises to forgive them. Right on, Scooter. Let's get ready to blast off, crew. All astronauts, click on your seatbelts. Click. click. Now help us rev up these jets by patting your legs with us. Countdown to blast off. Ready? Five, four, three, two, one. Blast off! Wow, this is my favorite part about being an astronaut. I just love being in outer space. Look at all the stars. Space crew, will you help us find the green dot planet? Yeah! Superb! Everyone look through your space helmets. Is that the green dot planet up ahead? Nope, that's the yellow square planet that we visited last week. Oh, here comes another one. Is that the green dot planet? I don't believe so. That looks like the rainbow stripe planet. Wait, wait, here comes another one. Is that the green dot planet? It sure is. Activate the rocket boost to the green dot planet. Hello, aliens! Hi, astronauts! I can't believe you guys came all the way to the Green Dot Planet. We are in timeout because we did not put on our shoes when our dad asked us to. Oh, no! I'm sure your dad will forgive you if you say you are sorry. And we're sure that God will forgive you, too. Really? How do we know that God will forgive us? We know that God promises to forgive us from a story in the Bible. Astronauts, was today's story about a girl named Jessica or a boy named Jonah? A boy named Jonah! Ooh, we can ask our dad to read us Jonah's story when we get out of time out. But astronauts, can you tell us what happened in Jonah's story? Of course we can! You see, Jonah disobeyed God and ended up in a boat in the middle of the ocean. 
space crew. When Jonah was out in the sea, did he get swallowed by an itty bitty snail or a great big fish? A great, great big, big fish. fish! Oh no, what happened when the big fish swallowed Jonah? Well, when Jonah was inside the fish's belly, he prayed and he said sorry to God for disobeying him. Then God forgave Jonah and he spit him out into dry land. <laughs> God forgave Jonah and he'll forgive you and me when we say we are sorry. Say it with us, boys and girls. God promises to forgive me. Marvelous marches. I'm so glad that God promises to forgive us when we disobey and do wrong things. Let's tell God we are sorry right now. Dear God, we did not obey our dad. We are very sorry. Please forgive us. We love you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Phew, I feel better now. When our dad gets us out of time out, we need to tell him we are sorry too. Astronauts, I am so glad you came to our planet. Let's see if astronaut Chelsea has a craft to help us remember today's story. <laughs> Astronaut Chelsea here. Today we're recording on Earth because my spacesuit is in the shop. So today we learned about Jonah and the whale. So today, craft all we need is paper plates, some scissors, and an older sibling or your parents to help you cut, some glue, some blue crayons, and little googly eyes. So we're gonna go ahead and start with just coloring our plates blue. Better if you have a white plate because it'll be easier to go ahead and color it. We want to make sure we get both sides so we can make our whale. So we're just going to color. Good job, Daniel. Once you're done coloring, you want to ask an older sibling or your parents to help you with the scissors. And we're just going to go ahead and cut out at an angle, kind of like a pizza or a pie slice. And then from there, we're just gonna go ahead and fold the, um, we'll fold it back, put a little bit of glue. Go ahead. <laughs> All right, so we put glue on the eyeball and then we'll put just a little bit of glue on the back to hold it down. And you now have your whale to remind you of Jonah and the whale. Hope you kids have a wonderful week. See you next time. Bye. I'm so glad that we got to tell the aliens on Green Dot Planet that God promises to forgive you and me. Now they know that they can say they're sorry when they do wrong things and that God will forgive them. Right on, Scooter. Looks like it's time to head back to Earth. Everyone, let's help guide our rocket through the solar system and back to our planet. Hey, let's sing a song while we're flying back. Great idea, Scooter. This is how I love my God. This is how I love my God. This is how I love my God. This is how with my hands and my feet with my mouth and with the
space mission with us? Yeah! yeah! Great, we'll see you soon. And always remember, God promises to forgive me. So long, astronauts. See you later. Hello, astronauts. Will you please pray with us? Dear God, dear God, we love you. We love you. We trust you. We trust you. We thank you for loving us and taking care of us. We thank you for loving us and taking care of us. Amen. Amen. Astronauts, get ready to help us guide our rocket back to Earth. Lean left, lean right, duck down, jump up, and clap to fire. Here we go. Lean left. Lean right. Clap to fire. Duck down. Lean left. Clap to fire. Duck down. Jump up. Lean left. Up to fire. Duck down. Lean right. Good job, astronauts. See you next week.